Oh, okay. Hello everybody, welcome back to um, Fire Emblem. So, what chapter are we on? It's been six weeks since we even touched this game. Uh, oh, we're on the chapter that's in the dark for this game. Dark chapters aren't fun. No, like, no, oh, there's an enemy. It's the fog chapter, which isn't the dark chapter, oh my God. but it's just as sucky. Alright, so, the fog chapters in this game give me such a hard time. I still haven't passed the part in my playthrough. So... Alright. Who are we kicking off the team? Lin, 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 Lin. You're not helpful. Um, do we need three sword users? Sure we do. Uh, let's do. By the way, uh, what do you think of the thumbnails that I've been doing recently? I've liked them. I thought they've been pretty good. Um, Even though they're just the, um, just uh, the PNGs from Heroes, I think it just works well. I mean, I would personally tailor them a little bit more to the episodes. There's one where it was like Elliewood was in the thumbnail and he didn't even like do anything in the episodes. So. That was just because I put something together and that was the one that oh, yeah, wasn't even up. I, I forgot to like, well I forget, but I didn't have time to like mess with it. So so I just kind of slapped Elliewood on like, yeah, he's a main character. It works. <laughs> and hey, oh, you, could, you should at least be God. happy okay. that I used um, legendary Elliewood and not regular Elliewood. I didn't like give people seizures. <laughs> oh. We're gonna give him a weapon actually, cause it for me one time, right out of his neck. <laughs> yeah, it's, like... it's so brutal. That like actually makes me like, ugh. Okay, the assassin animations in this game are freaking rad. And oh my god, I can't use Florina. Hey, should chapter. I get rid of my sixty dollar unit? <laughs> Where, where did you even redeem him? I never got him. Is it too late? You have to uh, link your Nintendo... I um, did, and it didn't do anything. Oh, I'll, I'll have to show you. There's, like, videos online. You have to link your um, uh, uh, Nintendo Switch account with your, like, Nintendo thing or email or something. I don't know. Oh, yeah, I forgot Guy is destroyer of worlds in this run. Uh, yeah. What the... <laughs> he just dabs on the entire enemy team. Um, speaking of which, I was looking through our videos the other day. We have a lot of, uh, no, I was looking through our videos the other day and the thumbnail style that we did before current is awful. Yeah, I, that's why I wanted to switch. Cause it was like, oh, we get odd uh, dart by the way. Um, he's the unit that we didn't kill a few episodes back and he's, he's pretty good. He's Where's just the board. <laughs> Shut up. The problem with, like, any axe units in this game is, is literally that they're not Hector, and it's like, why would you use them if they're not Hector? Because Hector is so good. I thought those like, armored tank units in this game. <laughs> we'll just have all my axe units go this way. So I do have a question for you. Mm -hmm. And I want to keep this relatively Fire Ember related, but talk about things that aren't this game. So... Freaking how many abyssal maps have you cleared in Fey? Ah, uh, two. I have cleared none. I have gone very close twice. The only reason I've cleared two is because I looked. Well, okay. I've cleared two on my own. I've cleared like probably five because I was like, hey, I want that cosmetic. Let's look up a Reddit walkthrough. Oh my. Also, frick. the people who just like use a very certain unit, also nice crit. Um, She's gonna die, I'm pretty sure. Probably. Because I forgot about the archer. Please miss this shot. If it's 69 hit, there's no... Alright, restart the level. <laughs> I was gonna say. Um, but the people that, like, build a single unit just because they like them are the people that terrify me the most. Okay, I personally hate the people who say, like, oh, any unit's good with the right investment. Because it's like, obviously... If you're giving people, like, freaking distant counter and, like, quick repost and everything else, they're gonna be a usable unit, but it's like, if I give Silif those things versus if I give, um, Carla those things, right. one of them is gonna be a lot better. Um, we should probably do this, because... My god, Ken's doing well. But yeah, it's like... <laughs> One of those guys is going to do a whole lot better. The, the scary thing is, the scariest people are the so late people. 
Soleil is a really good unit to build, but I she's I find her boring because she's just a ball of stats. Like I use my Ike because uh, Radiant Aether is bullcrap. <laughs> um, I once got someone to try the game just because I showed them Ike's Radiant Aether animation. It's not even as Radiant Aether. It's as normal. Animation. Well, you know. The animation that he does when he gets a special. Yeah. Also, I'm eating Aiden's Chipotle chips, and I hope he doesn't murder me. He said they're for all of us, and if he's going to take that back right now, he can go frick himself. But, so, I don't know if I told you, but I got Bryson in to pay for a while. Oh, yeah. One of his first pulls was, like, a Surter. <laughs> it was plus speed, and I'm like, rip, but also it's Surter, so, uh... It's hard to make Surter bat. Surter's one of those units where it's like three of any stat is not gonna matter because of the rest of his stats are really good. Also his weapon, also one of his skills is freaking bonkers. Yeah. Like should not exist. And, you, and it's just the one that like, oh hey, you exist next to me, time to die. They should have made it like they did the new, um, not the all in the leaf, um, where it's like only if the player's controlling him. That was a great addition to the game. Also, the new leaf has uh what's it called? Wow. You think you think I know what the special skill is called after like having Roy with it for so long. Gale Force. Gale Force. He has Gale Force, but instead of five, it's three. It's okay, it's you can only move one space though, which is like the real drawback because he's a cavalry unit and he wants oh. all the movement he can get. I think that's his weapon though. No, no 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 it's so... a skill. Yeah, the, the skill basically, it gives him Gale Force and then inflicts gravity on him, so it's like, if you can picture that. Hey, is there any way to counteract that? No. Well, it, it's not actual gravity, it's like a version of gravity that is unique to that weapon. You're like, yeah, you tried, kind of. I mean, his art just looks, like, so, some of the stuff in the, sign, yeah. some of the thing in fact it's just i love how all the characters look different mm -hmm. and some of them are like actually designed by people who Hello. worked on the games like i think the person who made his design for Faye worked on some of the art in thracia so that's cool oh yeah yeah um and so also uh the art for the new units the uh Echoes units that came out. Mm -hmm. It wanted me to get like all of those units immediately because the art is amazing on all of them. Yeah. I specifically want to get Katria because I've had two uh, Fire Emblem Heroes accounts ever. Um, my first one was on my tablet and I didn't have my Nintendo account linked to it and I swear it gave me two stars uh, from summons. It didn't. That's just not a thing. I feel like it did. But uh, anyway. Literally, the only five star I ever got was a Catria. <laughs> she carried me through the story mode. I kid you not. So I, it's just kind of like that nod to Catria that I want like another one. I okay. So I did something similar. I um did. I got like a secondary Fire Emblem Heroes account because I just wanted to see like, hey, what units can I pull? Mainly it was to test out. I think the Brave Heroes that just came out. I was like, I want to get Ike. I want to test him out, but I'm going to get Lin on my main No, you one. really want to get Ike. <laughs> well, yeah, it's, it's really good now, but I got it, and my like, first pull ever was a five-star Subaki back when he was in the five-star pool. And <laughs> I was... a joke. He was, like, plus speed minus HP, which was perfect IV, so I'm like, I'm just going to try him out and see what he does. And I kid you not, I put Fury on that boy and inherited a Slaying Lance, and he had, like, 40 in every stat. It was ridiculous. For him. 40 in every stat's amazing regardless. I, I think it was his res or something was a little bit low, but... I think someone made, like... some. They had to do something, like, really specific, like jumping through hoops. But they made it so that it was all 69. <laughs> I mean, yeah, obviously you're not gonna just get that. Let me see. So, I'm gonna look at my original team real quick. Um... <coughs> So basically for this, I just go to the obtained and like see. So it was a Faye, a Cordelia, a Raven, and a Setsuna. That was my original team. And I'm pretty sure the Cordelia carried me simply because she had Death Blue 3, Breath of Life, and Gale Force. Oh. So basically she was an ambulance. 
<laughs> Breath of Life is not a very good skill, though. It's not. <clears throat> um, and then Raven just kind of killed things oh, after hello. looking at them, but he's uh, minus attack plus defense. And if you know anything about oh, Raven and sucks. Fire Emblem Heroes, yeah. you want literally anything except for plus defense and resistance. And then Setsuna just HP. has 40 attack, and she's minus speed. Whoa, where did you come from? Boop. And let me see. Somehow... Look, look at... Alright, so... Shortly after pulling a... Uh, well, shortly after pulling my oh Brave my God, Roy, Raven. my free ba Brave Roy, I then got Brave Ike. Like, oh. not even that shortly God. after. Honestly, okay. I hate fog levels with cavalry archers in them. That never missed. So we're gonna restart and then also use save states because this is the dumb Who's one. Who's that? Uh, Fiora? The green one. Yeah. So I think yeah, oh, that's, yeah, that's the, the only one reason I brought her. Unit that everyone freaked out. All about. right, restart the level. And I'm I'm literally Control going to save state on every turn. I mean, it's worth it. Uh, yeah. Okay, it's like if I gave a crap and was actually focusing, I, I wouldn't. But uh. yeah, well, we're here, we're now, and we don't care. Anyway, launch the chip. Okay, there's my save state button. So, yeah, it's like you were, we were talking about something else before Pharaohs, and I forget what it was. What? We were talking about something else before Pharaohs, and I forget what it was. Pharaohs. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, pokey birds. All right. Oddest question of the year. Everyone's been wanting to know. What is your pokey sona? God, shut the frick. <laughs> you want to know what a lot of people... did? Alright, so... Because we're talking about Pokemon now, I want to ask. Did you take part in that big Reddit, uh... Like, what's your favorite Pokemon? Where it was, like, reposted everywhere? Oh, yeah, the one where it's like, hey, every Pokemon is someone's favorite. And there were, like, literally five that, according to whomever, according to the people who participated, were, like, five who weren't anybody's favorite. I feel like some people purposely chose weird ones, though, just to, like... I legitimately chose. Oh, you did, but I'm sure some people were just like, hey, it's... A What's your favorite one? Hmm, it's hard to say. It's, it's between, like, a few dragon types. You're basically just Lance. He said, yeet! <laughs> Raven says no. Oh, you hit me? Well, fool, it was my plan to get Mom hit all Mom says along. yes, but Raven says no. That's okay. Um. But. You're just Lance. That's it. I mean, I don't know. Between Dragonite, Gudra. What other Pokemon do I like? I'm trying to even think. Um, I like Greninja. He's Everyone cool. likes Greninja. I was going to say this. It's like saying that, um. Marth is your favorite Fire Emblem character. It's like, yes. It's generic pick. Um, uh, mine's been Micaiah for a while. But I also really liked um, Silas. Um, what the frick, Kent? I liked Silas and Fates, and I liked... Uh, shoot, what's his name? Kaze? Oh, I'm those not, are weird not, Pokemon. Not Kaze. Um, what, what's... Sizo, is Sizo the angry one? Yeah, the angry last his... guy. No, yeah, I like I liked his brother more. And then when he died, I'm really I was really upset, and I'm saying that because nobody cares about fates anymore. Shout out to Fire Emblem Six where they forgot to add uh, horse archers to the list of things that rapiers were effective against. Really? Yeah. <laughs> they... Fire Emblem Six was a weird game. Enemy wyverns had so much freaking stats, it literally took four of your units to kill one of them on hard mode. And they also sent like four of them in at a time on hard mode. I'm here to deliver a message to you that you do not exist! <laughs> mm. Oh, Lowen finally gets a level in the first time, like, ever. I cannot okay. see. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he forgot to level up the stats because he just couldn't see him. You see, I've had my... Alright, 
Dude, we're hopping around a lot this episode, but I actually wrote down my favorite Pokemon. It's like because ADHD emblem. <laughs> I do. I do. I do. Yes. 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 What actually, the flux. I only have a sixty-six hit. Where is it? Hit um, this, you nerd. Thank you. So I, I literally wrote down the favorite Pokemon of mine. <laughs> so, okay. Embor is first. Second is Meowstic. Third is Eevee. Fourth is Beedrill. And then, I don't have a fifth one yet, I, I'm looking like... Because a lot of them are designed really well, and sometimes I pick on design alone. Because... I mean, yeah, if you're picking on stats... Like, I'm not even that much of a nerd. I'm not gonna pick a Pokemon, like, based on stats, unless it's so good. <coughs> like... Embor was the first Pokemon I ever got. And so... Well, Tepic was, but you know. And... Closer your pal, I mean, yeah. I built my Emborn to like single-handedly take out like half the Elite Four by itself. Also, I did that with I am in X and Y. If you have Xerneas, it can learn enough moves that it can take on uh, Diantha by itself and win. Oh, <laughs> um, which I did do just to prove it, and I laughed like when I was done. I just don't like Xerneas's design. Yeah, it's kind of weird. I mean, it's good, just not my kind of thing. I, I like the design of that new electric type legendary. I forget what it's called. Uh, Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon? It starts with a Z. Yeah, it does start with a Z. Zero or I think. I don't know how you get it, but... It looks cool, that's all I'm saying. Yeah, I... Alright, I never get any of those, just because I never know how. Oh, frick. So... Okay. What was the first Pokemon game you played? Uh, Emerald. Emerald Flash. Mine was. I, I think I've said this before, but like, I got gifted a DS Lite for my birthday once. Oh yeah, it's black and white. Yeah, black and white black too, because I bought that with my own money, pre-owned. Neither of those was the first game I played. Black and white too at the same time. White too. <laughs> oh, well, that was convenient. Or she just moved next to floor. Yeah, she's not. She doesn't normally do that, so it's like. She did it last round. Well, okay, maybe she does. I don't know. Uh, she has good stats, but her her growths are freaking stupid, and she also has like no good weapons to start with. So. Well. Well. Into the pool of useless units you go. Basically, though, she can be good if Florina turns out bad. And by can, I mean, like, if you're really, really lucky, she might or get some unlucky. good stat growths. Because in um, order for A, you must have B. Yep, this unit that everybody freaked out about. <laughs> I wish they'd add actual units into the game and not, like, hey, summer edition of a unit that we still don't have. Be sleeping. All right, peace. Um, they did, they did that with, uh, Shigure, or however the frick you yeah. say his name. Dancer, man. Yeah, they did his, um... Right. They um, did his dancer form first, and then they put him in the game after. And then they did that with Sigrun. Reminder that Charlotte is still not in the game, and they added her bridal form, oh my God, like, yeah. two years ago. Alright, Kent, don't let me down. A lot of people like her. Keep up your streak. That's okay. You got strength, at least. It's it's a stat that's important, I guess. All right, this dude has Nosferatu. I have the um. Speaking of no, uh, adding people to the game when they have alts. Freaking Lynn, Corin, and Camilla need to calm down. Oh yes, the waifus of the game. You can make entire teams out of them. Like, just the single... I think I can do oh, that Oh, no, you myself. can choose what teams to make. Like, it's, it's not like you're forced into one team. You can choose which ones or yeah. which alts you're well, making I think I can team. make a Camilla team. Do I have the... I have every copy of Camilla just by sheer chance I've pulled all of them. All right, so... You remember when I did the banner uh, a while back for, like, mm -hmm. uh, I think the second anniversary or something? Mm-hmm. I got Easter Camilla, and I was really mad about it. RIP! Oh, that's a terrible pull. I got, um... I think I got Jacob off of that, which is insane. Better than Camilla. Do you want to do any arena grinding, or just stick with the growths we have? Uh, you can. 
I might do a little because. Do it off camera. Okay. And I'm gonna be like, hey, I did this. I might if I ever get bored. The, the thing I hate most about Camilla. All right, there's one. I found at least one. <coughs> also, Robin, but I guess she doesn't. She and he don't have as many. Yeah. I have, I think, only two Camillas. Oh, pirates. Nope, three. Oh, hold up. It's just everyone from Fates has too many alts. Fates Awakening bias. Um, no, not even like Awakening. It doesn't even come close. They used Fates. to. Because you just have Azura, Corin, Camilla, and that's just half the game. Not to mention Camilla won a CYL, which is like, dear lord people. Because like, of her two big personalities. <laughs> and <laughs> her absence of pants. Yeah. She literally just does not wear pants. Her entire character is a thigh gap. No, her entire character is just a thigh. This is spooky. <laughs> and then this abomination came along. Oh, yeah. Well, all of the Camillas are abominations. And then there's this specific abomination. Oh. Okay, if Canis gets good growths, he's going to be really good just because of the Lunatome. Alright, so something that I found out is that the voice actor for Canis and Fire Emblem Heroes is the exact same person who voices Claude in Three Houses. Really? Yeah. Wow. I saw it the other day, and I added him on Twitter about it, and he replied to me. And I'm like, oh my god, he replied Drake to me. Josh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That was cool. Alright. I'm pretty sure if you use a torch on a thief, the effects stack, and you can just see everything ever. Maybe. I mean, these games are old enough. Usually they allow for, like, some shenanigans. Yeah, newer games, as they become polished, like, I don't know, they, they lose some of the charm of, like, wow, you can completely break this game if you want to. Uh, alright. And so, I don't know how recently you've been, like, browsing Reddit, but there was a new post to the TF2 subreddit. It was, saw this guy at, uh, BlizzCon. And it was a guy cosplaying as NG, and it said had two in the title before it was cool. Because <laughs> they got Overwatch 2. What else did they get, like, new? They got Spider-Verse 2, Overwatch 2, something else. Is Spider-Verse 2 a thing? Oh, yeah. Huh. Uh, let me see. I have it. Oh, we're gonna have to do something about that. <sighs> well, that's not good, Lottie. That's not very nice. Dart, do you have anything useful? Hector might just have to. Oh no. Let's see. I don't have any axes. Oh no. Oh, God. April 8th, 2022. That's a long ways off. Yeah, but they still announced it. I mean, yeah. Alright, Raven, go deal with my problems in life. All right, let's let's alleviate this commentary gap. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> um, there was something I wanted to talk about that you brought up. I'm like, oh yeah, that's a good discussion. And I don't remember what it was because we went into a uh, Fire Emblem Heroes. Um. Oh, that's. Let's see, what did I talk about before that? I think I started out on that. Um, maybe. I'm thinking of how long we actually have left on this game. Uh, not too darn long. <clears throat> We're doing a, a... I know Tucker especially said like, Oh, no long games. We don't want the... Oh, frick. Where'd he come from? Uh, the fog. Frick! Oh, no, we're good. He, I missed. Uh, I said something about... Buy left, like the $60 oh, unit. 
That was, I don't know. Anyway, that, that, that discussion just doesn't exist anymore, so no big deal. You no longer exist. How many units are in the fog today on... Mysteries that Hollywood? I want answers to, but not necessarily Hollywood, that bad. Hollywood, Hollywood. All right. Rape. If he gets a strength out of this level up, then I won't have to use the rapier. If he leveled up. Well... Oh no, weapon level increases might actually do things, so... Kind of how they, they had a very basic system of the, the thing that gives... So you know how weapon uh, mastery works in three houses where it's like... Um, the higher you get, the more like random perks like crit and hit rate and stuff. Oh yeah, the crit... Alright, the crit stuff is retarded. I know, you can get like 100% with Petra. <laughs> <laughs> well, I I didn't do Black Eagles. I did Golden Deer, obviously. Petra. Um, and Raphael just tears through people because he's a brawler, and he already has a high crit rate, mm. and he already doubles almost everyone in the game. He eventually Yolo. just gets like a speed, and he can just like he quads almost everyone in the game, and then he can quad and like crit oh, wow. on every single one i know and it's hilarious he's like time for seconds time for seconds time for seconds time for seconds i'm Raphael. i know your specialty is beating things not counting but i think that's like fifths at that point <laughs> for real he, he he literally says he i'm not smart. oh my god okay it's a slim he has 11 attack okay we're safe Everybody point and laugh at the poor kid. Laughing at the poor kid is like laughing at the disabled. What are they gonna do? Buy, buy uh, an insult? Like... Punch an orphan. Hey, if you ever feel bad, just punch an orphan. What are they gonna do? Tell their parents? What are they gonna do? Call the police? So oh, wait. Ugh. Where did they get a phone? From their parents before they died. It was their their grandfather's dying wish before they got sent off on their anime they quest. Got strength. I'm getting really tired of these extremely low hit chances uh, that the enemies have, and then the extremely high hit chances that I have, and it not going as planned. I feel like, because you saying hit rates made me think of this, I feel like um, Three Houses has the most, like, eh, screw it, I'll, like, like, never tell me the odds. Yeah. In the entire, like, I once hit someone with, like, a 10%, like... This looks fine. I had, like, a 3% crit rate, and if I didn't hit the crit, I was gonna die, and I had, like, no things left on, like, non-casual. I'm like, yeah, that's <laughs> fine. Okay. And I rolled the crit, and I just, like, obliterated this guy, and I felt really, like... I was, like, laughing, like, in the middle of the night, <laughs> playing this on my bed. I will say that um, Bernandetta, has, she, one of her skills is that she um, makes it so... Okay, so she gets like a free follow-up attack. Um, and I don't know how many times she can activate it, but it's like once per battle or something, she gets just another attack. And there was one time where I forgot to um, unequip the broken weapon that she had. And she got like attacked by an enemy at full health um the enemy missed a like 80 some percent hit that would have otherwise killed her she she was getting doubled too so she hits one shot with her bow and then gets her seal and then a crit and kills them and i was like all right i guess we just won't be resetting today that's cool <laughs> Oh, it's not even <laughs> resetting. It's just like, oh, guess we won't be hitting. It's rewind time today. Yeah, that's a, just an interesting mechanic. Right. I wanted to show you this real quick, and we can. We don't, this doesn't have to be thrown up, if you don't want to throw it up on screen. <laughs> but I want to I want to show you a specific clip that I took in my playthrough. Ready? All right. Should I put sound on or no? Uh, nah. All right, I know what it's like. this specific clip right here. And so I had this cavalier attack Ignatz, and he just deletes. And we'll do this. So he got two grits in a row, killed him. 
And, like, he's, like, totally, like, out in the open. Got attacked by a second archer, misses, and then crits again, kills him. <laughs> <laughs> yes, he has close counter. But, like, for real. I mean, he has 61 crit. It's not I like... know. His crit is... His crit and Raphael's crit just went through the roof at one point. <laughs> All right, back to this game because I kind of forgot to do inputs. Uh, I do have a question for Black Eagles because I Black Eagles is the last playthrough I'm gonna do. Mm -hmm. Just because I really hate Edelgard as I a mean, person. I mean, go for it. Um, are any units there like? Oh, I don't like to do this, but. Also, I'm really good at this. Um, I don't think so. I don't think they'd reuse that personality quirk. Well, Hilda, her entire personality is, I hate doing work. Also, Hilda can solo, like, several of the maps in the game. Like, you don't even have to <laughs> try and build... <laughs> Thanks. You, you don't even have to try and build Hilda for her to be, like, a lethal presence. Hilda. Hilda. Frick. Like, Even her strength it. stat goes through the roof, and you can give her, like, an iron axe, and she will destroy early maps. She will destroy late maps, too. Here, catch. <laughs> uh, no, no catches in return. I'm asking the questions here. I was playing catch. It's just an arrow going back and forth. <laughs> uh. Are any of these you high? Okay, no. You high is the dumbest. Okay. Who's you high? The boss who has really crazy weapons. Ooh, when's he gonna show up? I, I don't know where he is. I thought he was like I don't in, know where he is. I thought he was in this space here, which means he's in one of these other spaces. He's in the fog. We're gonna we're gonna do a, a reset because I'm actually curious. He's over what? there. He's gotta be. What? See what? Cap? He is in, he's has to be in this space because he can he is he doesn't move though all right yeah I don't want to actually put her there um well okay yeah so I was having I found out the reason why my game is like occasionally lagging is because I was having CPU issues really and it kind of it, it it's doing it now because I'm recording um, but I, everything I read was like, oh yeah, the, the CPU is having issues, you occasionally need to, um, yeah, there he is. Oh. Buy thermal paste and... Oh my god. Take off, yeah, let me see his stats, like, mm, gross. <laughs> he just has every bow in the game in his inventory. He oh, does! Nice. <laughs> He's like the Hector of bow users, but, um... The guide was like, oh, yeah, if you're having issues, you actually need to, um, like, turn off your computer, take out the CPU, remove the thermal paste, put some new one on, um, reseat it, um, then download, like, a temperature monitoring app that'll tell you if it's overheating, and I was like, okay, does that make sense? And then I restarted my computer to download the software, and it worked, and I, it didn't work the last time I restarted my computer, but this time it was okay. So, Hollywood. Beep. Also, I like how the rapier just goes right through them. <laughs> yeah, they. I love the um the stab mechanic of like, hey, my weapon is completely through you. Have you seen uh, it, the Hector comic? I know what you're gonna say. No, 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 no. Oh no, the yeah, other one. Strength, thank you. Slide, he just slides up yeah. the pole. I've seen that one. No, I'm talking about the. Uh, uh, what's his name? Oh, he starts with a sword? That's weird. Micaiah's brother. Oh. Or whatever he is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sooth. Sooth. Where he's dodging and he's like, uh, faking backwards, or fainting backwards. Mm-hmm. Uh, and like, there's a javelin and it's just through his chest and it just says, <laughs> miss. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> It reminds me of like the old XCOM memes that are like your the barrel of your gun is in like the <laughs> enemy's mouth, sixty three percent hit rate. <laughs> like, yeah, what are they gonna do? All right. <laughs> oh my god, this how much avoid? Forty eight. Why? <laughs> it said, hey. What if you didn't play the game? Here, wait, watch this. We can make him have a range battle with Hector. That's always fun. <laughs> I, I want him to equip a bow because then I can just, like, ass-blast him with every other <laughs> unit in the game. 
That's accurate. Uh, I will say, some of the CPUs in Fire Emblem are the most exploitable. Oh, yeah, they're... <laughs> like, even modern Fire Emblem is, like, really exploitable, because, like, they're very predictable. There's, like, a 99% chance that this guy doesn't move. But in the 1% that I'm wrong, I'm gonna cry. <laughs> are, you... are you the one responsible for... Oh, yeah, Lila died. We kind of skipped the cutscene. Who's Lila? Um, a thief that was, like, a friend of Matthew's. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> kind of. Ouch, I hurt. Okay, that's actually not very good His for Hector's sprite health. sprite looks boss, though. I know, they, they did such a good job with sprites in this game. Okay, well, you unequipped your sword, you dummy. Too bad. Uh oh, you made a serious... E -what -e. Oh, oh, I should get how... the forever box. How heavy is the longbow? Ten heavy, okay. No, he can wield that, never mind. I was gonna say, we can, like, weigh him down. Blow him down. I need to... Yeah, we're gonna killing edge guy him. G-U-I. Gooey. We. Golden ween. Ho! Oh, dang. Actor's just like... 22 you damage. You do not exist! I'm gonna try this. Oh hey, my nice. god. Okay. Hector just... The, yeah, we're just gonna um, make him not in that square anymore, though, because I'm pretty sure he would die. Yes, yeah, I just end your turn. Should be fine. He'll try to attack guy. By try, I mean if he hits. What did he say to him? Just some generic line. The only lines I'm not skipping are the dialogues with Hector because they're funny. Get out of the way, kills a man. Woo. Okay, 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 okay. Uh. Who needs this the most? Sane and Ken are equal level. It'd be really funny. Ravens fricked off all the way up here, so I don't know how much I can do with them. Oh. Pardon me. <laughs> uh, I'm just thinking about the thing that we did earlier with the Astral Chain now, because I just ripped one. Thanks. <laughs> the, the, pardon me, but I have just farted. <laughs> uh. Yes. <laughs> Spencer! I'm sorry. Uh, I tried to make that one quiet. Uh, we just lost a subscriber for that one, I'm pretty sure. Uh oh, bro, you just posted cringe. You just made cringe. Alright. Guy, don't make me sit here and rig this critical hit forever. Okay, this <laughs> is good enough. Uh. Alright, so I don't know if you know, but in uh, three houses, it doesn't matter how many times you uh, rewind, you can't get a crit, or... Yeah, so this is that's not how save states work, but, uh... I know, but, like, it's predetermined, and that makes me actually... Mm, Calvinism. Upset. <laughs> I made a good joke there, and you didn't laugh. Frick you. Frick! What's Calvinism? Um, it's a form of Christianity that believes in predestination. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Here's a funny prank for the kids. Gonna say the called Gamble My Life. He's a dark mage because he can say the N word. No, 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 no. Uh, that video that I showed you. <laughs> I did not expect him to laugh that much at it. <laughs> Why? Where, where are we doing these levels? These levels are dumb, and I'm frustrated with this chapter. Oh no, not you. Not you. I, I, I told myself I wouldn't do this, but at some point you just say like, yeah, I kind of need better levels to beat the game. At some point you just say, ooh, ooh. Hey, well, you know what? I know I know a way to get like cheats. Whoa, in. whoa. Okay, found the fast forward da -da 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 -da. <laughs> Banger. I was listening to a really good song. Hey, so, speaking of, like, using save states and stuff and cheating in games that you really shouldn't cheat in... Oh, whoa, 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 okay. That was a good level. We about missed it. Um, so, like, I posted on my Twitter that I, I had just beaten Minecraft, and I'm like, you know what? I'm gonna go try end busting, which is where, just where you go to the end and, like, raid an end, end, end fortress. Mm -hmm. Why can't I say that? And I hop into the portal. You wanna know what happens immediately once I hop into the portal? <laughs> what? I just sit there and I'm like I can't move, 
and I close the game, reload, and it drops me into the void with full diamond gear. Oh no! My di- my diamond sword that had like it could kill anything in like two hits, non crits, and it was just. So I'm just like you know what, frick it! I'm gonna give myself sixty six levels because that's how much I had, and I'm gonna cheat in the armor and stuff. Cause... Imagine not using not drop on death. Well, I I. Oh wait, that's the episode. Crap. Oh, thanks for All watching, right, everyone. Bye.